Well, because I haven't talked about religion in quite a long time here, I'm gonna go say something. <clears throat> I'm not an atheist. Okay, technically, I was never actually an atheist. What it is is that um, I'm agnostic. <laughs> If you guys been following me for a long time, you've seen my, my very early videos about that. Um, I kind of had that thought anyway, but you know, it's just easier to take the title of atheist because um, I, I had lumped myself in with, with online atheist groups for a while because, you know, they were the only ones that could relate to me. But all in all, I'm not completely an atheist. I don't believe that there's nobody out there, you know. I just don't believe in the God that most people believe in. Everybody out here, whatever entity they're worshiping, they not it. You know, like that's fucking obvious at this point. Um, that entity, whoever they're worshiping, if it even exists for that matter, is um not the right one. And I've had that feeling for a long time. Me and my husband both. We we're um. You know, it's hard to believe that there's nothing out there. There's nobody out there. You know, some people they believe in like spirit guides, and I'm more along the lines of believing in spirit guides. And possibly, I have this thought too. You know, the god that we're supposed to be worshiping, black people. If you know what I mean. Um, the entity that black people were are originally supposed to be following. Oh shit. Um, is not here. If you know what I mean. If you can think on that type of wavelength, you'll know what I'm talking about. Like, I just don't feel they're here. Like, they're actually on this plane where they're unreachable. It's as if we can't reach them. I mean, we I believe we can reach them through our thoughts and meditation. I believe we can reach them, you know, if we put ourselves on a higher plane and we meditate and all that other jazz. And we stick to it and we don't let too many worldly things deviate us. But... This so-called, as they call, white man's god. Mm -mm. The god they pushed on us during slavery. Mm -mm, he ain't the one. Um, that I believe that's the total wrong entity. This whole god and devil thing. I mean, um, yeah, god and Satan. That whole thing is is twisted. You know, if you've done any research on that, if you're any bit of awake with that. <clears throat> then you'll know what I'm talking about because, like I said, I believe it's all twisted. It's all twisted. The God and Satan thing is all mixed up. What is what if good is evil and evil is good? Think about that. What if everything they told you was good was actually evil and vice versa? Ha. Huh. I just don't believe what everybody else believes. And that's why I call myself agnostic because I do believe that there are other beings, there are other spirits, there are other entities out there. We just might not be able to reach them because of what? The chemtrails in the sky and all the other shit they've been poisoning us with. They've distracted us for so long. They've destroyed this world from what it's supposed to be. No wonder we can't reach our true calling. You know, we can't reach who we're supposed to be reaching. I don't believe that the God that we're all told to talk about in church is the real one. I just don't. The whole God, you know, with, with uh, Jesus as his son and the Holy Spirit, all of that, no. I, I just don't, I don't believe that. And like I said, I'm not totally atheist, and that's why I'm not totally atheist, because I don't fully believe that there is no one watching. I don't fully believe that no one has a spirit God. I don't believe that I don't have a spirit God. You know, I do believe anything. There are people who have meditated, and they've seen beings during their meditation. Who's that? They've seen friendly beings. Um, Even my husband has been through that. It's so like, you meditate and you see something in your meditation that calms you. You know, it's not a bad thing. It's some, You see something calming 
and you're gonna wonder what is that is that another entity is that another being from another world you know there's a lot of things we don't understand because again the fucking chemtrails and the food all the shit they've poisoned us with for centuries they've poisoned us for centuries so that we can't reach our true um entity i guess no i can't say it. <laughs> our true um frequency you know what i mean you know about frequencies then you know hey you probably get it but i just don't believe we can reach our, our true anything because like i said they poisoned us so much and that's why we all believe in the false god i do believe that not necessarily false because if he does exist like i said he's not the right one that god that entity that they shoved on us is probably the real satan because again think about it flipped that god is probably the real satan the real bad guy they've painted um they probably pushed somehow i don't know how this how this happened if it did but they've pushed our entity out far away from our minds so we don't think nor ever hear of that of them and they've pushed the one that we're not supposed to be listening to or paying attention to the one that's not for our people you know i believe that the entity that everybody else is following is not for colored people that's just the basis of it that's just the, that's just the grounding you know <clears throat> it's pretty obvious at this point <clears throat> that that entity is for slavery that entity is for separation and they are for the destruction of this world and i'm not with that i mean quite naturally if you open your mind up you'll you'll get it i'm just not with that so wow somebody got road rage so frankly that's why i'm not an atheist i'm not an atheist i'm an i'm agnostic because i believe wow yeah i do believe we have a being out there that's supposed to be looking after us we're supposed to be in contact with it we're supposed to be able to reach them we're supposed to be able to do a lot of other phenomenal things that we've heard about you know teleportation and all of it. i mean that sounds crazy but you know we're supposed to be able to do a lot more shit. i'll just say that you know your mind is a powerful thing we're supposed to be able to do a whole lot more and i feel it every day the more you get into nature the more you start opening up and the more you start realizing some things y'all gotta get into nature like seriously um, pay attention to nature. Every time I take a walk out here, I'm so drawn to these trees. It's like the trees are talking to me. I feel like the trees are telling me some things. And I've been feeling that way for years. I'm just so drawn to trees. Because, you know, trees know everything. Trees have been around for a long time. You know, even if these aren't the original trees. You know, like they've, um, they've been degenerated just like we have. They're not the original trees that used to be here thousands of years ago. But still, they know. They know everything. Nature knows, y'all. Nature knows. Nature knows who our true entity is. Nature knows who we're supposed to be following. So just pay attention to nature. The closer you get to nature, the more you'll understand these things. That's all I gotta say, because if, if you're baffled and you don't know what the hell I'm talking about, then that's why. <laughs> but anyway, if you're following my channel in the first place, if you're subscribed to me, then you know how I think a little bit. So there it is, y'all. So I wanted to talk about that because, like I said, it's been a while. And, um, yeah, it's been a while since I've talked about religion, but I just wanted to put that out there. I'm not an atheist. And I don't criticize, um, people for being atheists. The only thing I don't like about most atheists, most hardcore atheists, don't believe in anything. They just believe in, oh, science. Science is here, and, um, we've made progress because of science. Well, somebody had to give you that science. Somebody had to give you that technology. Somebody formed, somebody created that stuff. Somebody got it from somewhere. You know, half the shit we have now is not, um, real. Half the shit we have now is alien technology. I'll just say that. That's a whole nother topic. I'm just, I'm, I'm not even gonna touch on that, y'all. I'm just I'm not. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm done yapping. <laughs> I'm gonna go finish my walk and head home. So I can chillax with my fam and that and stuff like that, you know. And yeah, I had a good workout. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go finish my walk now and have fun. I hope you guys are having a great day because this day is beautiful. I'm so glad I came out here I'm feeling great. Um, yeah. Thank you all for watching me. Peace out. <laughs>